أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على خاتم النبيين وبعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Today I am going to speak about the third type of nafs the soul or the self and that is nafsi al-mutma'inna the satisfied soul the peaceful soul Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in surah al-fajr verses number 27 to 30 bismillahir rahmanir rahim يا أيتها النفس المطمئنة ترجعي إلى ربك راضية مرضية فدخلي في عبادي ودخلي جنتي O peaceful and fully satisfied soul, return to your Lord. You are well pleased. That means with your good end. You are well pleased and well pleasing. That is in the sight of your Lord. You are well pleasing. Join my righteous servants and enter my paradise. This is the satisfied soul, the nafs al-mutma'inna. And uh, he will be giving this good news at the time of death and also in the, in the field of gathering and also in grave. He, that means he will be given uh, satisfaction that he is going towards the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now, now how this uh, uh, satisfied soul became so much in peace? Because this is the person who believed in Allah, the one as his Lord and sustainer and adopted the way of life brought by the Prophet. Salam, as his way of life with full satisfaction of heart and without the least doubt about it who knew who accepted who acknowledged as absolute truth whatever commands he received from Allah and his messenger from Allah directly that means in the Holy Quran this is for our ummah But for every Ummah there was a Prophet and there was a Book of Guidance. So who considered the Book of Allah as absolute truth? And whatever command he received from Allah and his Messenger, he accepted that to be the absolute truth. He abstained himself from every type of disobedience, uh, for whatever he was forbidden, by Allah's religion, he abstained himself from that. He protected himself from that, not unwillingly, but happily, with the depth of his heart. And he saw that there were people who were enjoying life, who were very happy, uh, on the basis of disobedience to Almighty God, who didn't obey Allah's commands and who were not thinking about the hereafter and who were enjoying this life, but he was not impressed by them. He was happy, he was satisfied to keep away from all those errors in which that people were involved, who didn't believe in the hereafter, who were, had chosen only the life of this world. This satisfied person, satisfied soul, he understood and he believed that the errors, the mistakes, the evils in which they are involved, their end will be very bad. And although he is facing difficulties, he has to make sacrifices, but he, his end will be very good. So, Alhamdulillah, his end will become very good and he will be met with these words, Ya ayyatuhan nafsul mutma'inna turji ila rabbi kiradiyatam mardiyya. Oh, the satisfied soul, you return to your Lord. In such a case that you are pleased with him and Allah is pleased with you. And you enter 
Allah's righteous servants and enter Allah's paradise. Now, they, uh, these three are the, the, the types of um, nafs. This person was uh, trying to protect himself and herself from all types of disobedience to Allah and his messenger. So he got this satisfied soul, nafsi mutmainna. That means nafsi mutmainna is the one, is a nafs, is a soul which is satisfied with all good deeds, with true faith of Islam and with the, with the, with the obedience to all commands of Allah and his messenger. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us among these people who have the satisfied soul. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us those who listen to nafs lawama and protect themselves from evil deeds. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us from those people who listen to the nafs amara. Nafs amara which is accepting the invitations of Satan and get involved in evil deeds. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us from, the, from those. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us from those who have the nafs mutmainna and who listen to nafs lawama, whose nafs lawama, zameer, is strong. Ameen. Subhan rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifun. Wa salamun ala al-mursaleen. Walhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Allahumma salli ala muhammadin wa ala ala muhammad. كما صليت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد